Welcome to Paint With Me in Clip Studio Paint. Today we're going to ink a pencil sketch. This video is intended for you to work along, so at any time you can pause the video, update your own project in Clip Studio Paint, and then start the video back when you're ready. Pencil sketches can give your artwork a fun organic look if you keep the pencil sketch in there, or they can be the basis for a traditional painting technique. Uh, but if you want a clean line drawing, then you need to ink your pencils. So here I've loaded in a picture of Goofy, and the first thing that we want to do is we want to actually go in and change the opacity a little bit. So we're going to drop that opacity down so that we can uh, see our inking on top of this layer. If you want, then you can also lock that layer by clicking on the little padlock so that you don't accidentally paint on top of that layer. Add a new layer, and we can call it Ink. Next, you want to select your pen or paintbrush, and the main point here is that it shouldn't change its opacity as with pen pressure. It should change its thickness with a pen pressure, and so two popular pens are the G pen and the turnip pen. Turnip pen doesn't uh, change its thickness quite as much, so we'll start with that one. The next thing that you want to be aware of is that you want to have stabilization turned on to give you a smooth, clean line. That's found within the tool properties. Now we want to um, zoom in and pan over to an area that we want to work on. So I'm going to do uh, space shift to rotate so I can get a, an angle that I really like. So I'm going to try to just deal with this eye here. Now the other thing that I want to show is that I'm going to try to connect two lines here. So let's take a look at that and see the issue. So here I'm going to draw and as I draw, I'm not going to worry about getting exactly what that uh, original drawing is because we're just trying to create smooth lines and use this as a reference. Now, in this previous part of the drawing, I intentionally drew past this nose. And the point is, if I wanted to connect these two lines a little bit, um, I overlap. So how may, am I going to erase this to get this to look nice? So the easier way to do that is to actually create another layer. So I'm going to create another layer, and then I'm going to draw that nose through here. And what I'm going to do then, I'll zoom in some to that area. And now I will draw with um, transparency, and I can erase if I go to the correct <laughs> line uh, layer, and I can erase, and it makes a clean uh, connection between the two lines. Now that you've got two layers, you can actually uh, select both of them, and from the menu, we can select merge selected layers. You can also uh, merge um, to the layer below if you have the, the one on top, um, but there's, there's several ways that you can merge them. Now you may need to rename them after the merge, but that's basically all there is to it with respect to inking. Now of course you want to try some of these different pens so you can practice out line weights and um, just have fun creating inks from your pencil sketches.